Head Coach Hardy said that you have been working really hard to deserve this playing time. What do you think you've been doing that is making him trust you so much right now? Um, I think just keeping my work consistent, um, showing up every single day, uh, working as hard as I can, and uh, letting everything else, you know, um, deal with itself. Um, that's kind of how I've seen it, just, you know, showing up with a, with a positive attitude and the right mindset and just getting better every day and just staying ready. Your night started tonight with this monster jam. Tell me how that kind of got you loose because then you started hitting everything yeah. from there. Uh, coach, he, he drew that up in the, in, the, in the huddle and, you know, he said, get to your right hand and uh, finish strong. So, you know, that's what I did. And Mike, once we got out there, Mike was like, you know, I want you to dunk it. If you get the chance, dunk on somebody. So uh, I just went up there. It was a good play, um, but no, it was a good call. How did that give you energy, though? Because then you started really hitting from three. Uh, I mean, just, just as a, the dunk is all I need, I feel like, uh, just to get me going, just to, you know, get, get my energy up, um, turn up on defense, and then, you know, obviously just knock down that next shot that, that, that's available. I thought something really important was it wasn't just putting you in and getting you some minutes in random times. You were on the floor to finish this game defensively. What does that mean to you that he trusts you in that moment? Um, you know, it shows obviously that he has a lot of trust for me on the defensive end. Uh, I think just our activity and all the guys that were in at that time uh, were, were really clicking defensively, so we just kept it that way and uh, closed out the game in, in the best fashion you know, possible as far as you know, uh, building that lead. Rookies get into the league and they want it all now. How have you been patient and then be ready for your moments? Um, like I said, just just showing up every single day with a good attitude, um, not worrying about you know all the outside noise because there is so much outside noise. But not worrying about that, but really you know what uh, what everyone is is you know in in the Jazz what they're doing for me and um, you know what they're trying to do for me. So is it fair? We said it on the broadcast, but is it fair to say those were your best minutes as a Jazz man so far? Yeah, yeah, I would say those are. <laughs> okay, I love it when we're right. Thank you, Ochai. <laughs>